Hey guys, it's Jacob from Living Healthy Every Day. It's just after sunset, so I'm wearing my partially blue light blocking glasses. They help with when I'm looking at blue light on my phone or blue light on my laptop, and they're just slightly tinted to get rid of some of the blue light, so it seems more natural transition to the, uh, the redness that the sky puts out, and so I don't get migraines when I'm looking at my phone. And you can see more about this in the link below uh, where to get these kind of glasses. These are kind of bent, uh, they're, they're not the best, but they're cheap and they're nice and I look like Superman. So, I've got a, a very fascinating uh, story to tell you. So, let me ask you this question to start off. What New Year's resolution did you have when it was New Year's? What was your New Year's re resolution? Did you, did you have one? Did you have a New Year's resolution? Was it to go to the gym, uh, start eating he healthier, to, to uh, to, uh, to, to whatever it was. <laughs> mine was to, uh, so I found out I had bilateral dyskinesia, and so mine was to find out the root cause of my bilateral dyskinesia, and so that is something I've been working on every day, or once a week, or when it, it comes up, but I'm making sure that when things come to in mind that I do research on, that point, if it pinpoints to the gallbladder research, I stick to it and I find out how it connects. So that's something I do. But most people like, let's say the gym, will buy a new gym membership, they'll have great discounts, uh, but you'll see tons of people at the gym for the first week or two uh, in January, and then by the time February marches, it's completely empty. Not completely, but I would say one third or one fourth of what it was in January. And so why is that? Why are people, they have this, this, uh, this goal, this New Year's resolution, but they're not following through on it? What is that? So I'm gonna give you some ways that you, you can follow through on your goals and you won't quit to them. So the first step you wanna take is to get specific on what you want. So if you're specific, then you can track it. So you can, if you're specific, you can track exactly how it is. So specifically, let's say, for working out, I'm gonna go to the gym every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. I'm gonna do this amount of reps, this, that, and this, and you can count the amount of weight you put on every time. If you're not specific and you're just like, I wanna lose weight in general, well, you're not gonna lose weight. If you're specific in how much weight I wanna lose 20 pounds by this day, five pounds each week, then you get specific. The second step to reaching your goal is to get accountability. And that's either getting a coach or a trainer or just a friend to keep you accountable. So that's why when you go to the gym, you want to get a trainer, someone who's gonna yell at you and tell you to run and do your things that you need to do. Because sometimes we don't wanna do this ourselves. So we need accountability. That's why it's nice having a gym partner to go to the gym. And the third step is, third step is to give yourself credibility for what you do. So what I mean by that is every time you get those five pounds or every time you reach that goal that you, you worked out, you ate healthy, you ate the right thing or you found out something about your gallbladder like me, you celebrate, you pat yourself on the back, you're happy about it, you have to enjoy the process. Make it something enjoyable. With these three steps, you'll enjoy it, you'll, you'll be accountable and you'll have uh, credibility. Um, and uh, to, to accomplish this goal. So these are the three steps. The first is to get specific, then get accountability, and then celebrate once you reach those little steps, the little steps. So you don't have to celebrate the huge goal uh, or only celebrate the huge goal, you celebrate the little steps. So thanks guys for watching. Let me know in the comments below what your goals are for the new year, for the, the past New Year's, and what may, maybe you've done to accomplish them and what you want to do now to achieve your goals. So thanks guys for watching and stay beautiful.